Hey everyone, I'm Henry. I'm Ian. And we are Bosch. Bosch. We want to talk about climate change. You know, David Attenborough just had a show on the BBC called Climate Change The Facts, in which he said, our entire globe is at risk of losing ecosystems and collapse of our societies if we don't act now. He also said, which is amazing for someone so important as David Attenborough to say this, that the number one thing we can all do personally to reduce climate change is to reduce meat and dairy. Now, I haven't seen this documentary yet, but Henry has, so I want to hear all about it. I mean, it's mad, right? So, like, we read about this stuff all the time. If you think about it, what we do every day is we cook plant-based recipes for everybody, and it's all because of the climate that we do what we do. But to watch David Attenborough saying it on the BBC, which is going out to every single person in the UK, was shocking. And I think everybody was kind of wondering when he was going to touch on that. There's horrible things that you see in this show, actually. You see things like the collapse of glaciers. You just watch them, like giant glaciers the size of skyscrapers falling into the sea. There's that uh, shot of, uh, I think, Greenpeace did with uh, Ludovico Ainaudi yeah. sat on a boat with like the glaciers kind of just tumbling in and it's sort of, oh yeah, it's really nice and it's like beautiful, but in actual fact, it's not cool. The other thing he mentioned was the tipping points in the Arctic where you've got permafrost, which is just basically constantly frozen ground, solid. But in there are these giant bubbles of methane and that could all get released, mm. which is a much worse and more potent greenhouse gas than carbon dioxide. So if that were to melt, we're going to accelerate climate change even further. Yeah, and it's not, it's almost like if is a, a hopeful word. Yeah. But it's looking like when might be the thing here. Yeah. So there's the, we've got to worry about the sea level rises. We also saw in that show, you saw people driving through wildfires. Yeah. There was a guy and his son who drove through these wildfires. Now, uh, obviously, this is a very poignant documentary, but there's a lot of other media out there. We've listened to and read a book by a guy called David Wallace Wells recently, and that is a very, very interesting thing that you should probably listen to. If you haven't got the time for the book, go check out the Joe Rogan podcast. And they talk about all the other things, like seawater, sea level rises. I mean, we live in London. The idea of the sea level rising is kind of scary. Yeah. There's been some amazing stuff going on in London just now actually with Extinction Rebellion where thousands of people basically protested mm. to stop the government in their tracks and make them commit to getting to carbon zero. Uh, so that's been really inspiring yeah. that people are doing things about it. So really it's just about operating within your space. We can all make a really easy decision every single day. In fact we can make three decisions. The three decisions you can make are breakfast, lunch and dinner. Just eat plant-based food and that is going to really reduce your carbon footprint and really help you have less of an impact on the environment. We're changing the way we do things here at Bosch. We've always been about the climate, but we're going to be a lot more so. Mm -hmm. We're actually writing another book, which we've already announced, which is going to be climate focused and showing people how to reduce their meat and dairy consumption and live more vegan so they can help save the planet. So obviously we've left a whole bunch of trails in this video with loads of little links like the David Wallace Wells thing and the David Attenborough thing. We're gonna put all of those links down below in the subscription box, so check it out. We cook loads of plant-based recipes in case you are looking to cut down your meat and dairy. We're also gonna be talking more about climate change. So hit subscribe to stay in touch. And obviously drop a comment below, let us know what you think about this video. Tell us what you wanna see from us more and more. We're here for you.